actually really have had zero time to film at all. I've been super busy, um, but I am here with an unboxing. Actually, I'll be right back. Okay, now I'm back. Sorry. So, um, I had to get this item so that I could have this as part of my unboxing so I can show you what exactly it is that I have purchased. So we'll put this off to the side for now. Over there, I don't even know if you can see that, but maybe you can. Alrighty, so the item I got came from this big box from Fashion File. My boyfriend purchased this for me as a gift. It's a late Christmas present gift or just because gift, because he noticed it. So what it comes with are, oh, I'm so sorry. This is really difficult. So it is the thank you card from Fashion File and it's got a little heart on the back. It is the certificate um, is in here with all of your purchase receipt. I will open it up and let y'all know the price. Then there is the new Fashion File 2019 calendar. Super cute. Love that Gucci bag on the front. Look at that if you can see it without the ring in it. And then another Fashion File um, nail file. I have so many of these. Oh, that's cute. It says on the back, I like my money where I can see it hanging in my closet. All right, and then you open this up. This is completely fabricated because I have used this item for about a week now. I just have had no time to film. And it came in this Fashion File dust bag. No, it is not a bag or a handbag or anything that big. Um, it is almost the price of that, but it is not that. Now, this came with the original dust bag and not the original um, box. However, this is the Fashion File dust bag, which I really love the quality of. This is super, super good quality. I love that. And then inside of here, we have the original dust bag on the item. Now, this original dust bag, I'm telling you, cannot be for this item. I mean, it fits it perfectly, but this item came out in 2016 and was produced in 2016. This was not the dust bag that Louis Vuitton was using in 2016, unless I'm completely wrong and or this was bought in Paris and it had a different type. But this is like a velvet feel. And this just does not seem right to me. I feel like this had to have been to another item, but we will see. So um, I will do some more research on that as I have time. And then inside of here to reveal the beautiful Toiletry 26 in the Poppy collection. Oh my God, I love it. Let's see if you can get an up close of it. Like that. It has a little bit of chipping. Hmm, where was that at? Let me see. Just the tiniest bit right there. I don't know if you can see it because it's super, super little. Right there and then right there. But that's all the chipping on the whole piece. The um, It's a continuous piece of canvas all the way around. And this is the orange poppy with the blue seeds. They also have a pink one. And I will get something in the pink at some point in my life, but this is good for now. And then it is super patinaed on the little leather Vachetta tab. And it is made in France. This item was produced in 2016 with the gold hardware in really, really good shape. Almost not even used shape hardware wise. So um, I don't know if it was used very much, but I certainly will use it. And then inside um, has my stuff in it. So I will take that out for a second so I can show you the beautiful interior. Let's see, I will also go over what's inside of it because I have been carrying it for the past week, like so. So inside of here, I have the Samorga organizer and it is this beautiful orange interior. Let's see if you can get a good glimpse of that. Pretty orange and beautiful, very clean. Needs a little bit of a wipe out because I had used some stuff in there earlier this week, but um, before I put the organizer in, 
But other than that, it is beautiful. It's in great shape, not dry, not bubbling, definitely in great shape. And then still, it is the wipeable interior that comes in these. So now I have a total of two of these in my collection, both of which are in use at the moment. Let's see, there we go, the front. This one, you can tell, has more of like a bent in shape because it's been in storage for a while, I can tell. Um, but like it's been flattened a little bit. However, this one has not. This one's still pretty new. Um, this one is a very smushy canvas and this one is not. This one's very, very stiff and this one's super smushy. Like here, I think I can show you. So like right here, like look at this. It's like super like smushy. Now same thing, barely does it. Like the inside part doesn't move. And then um, the base of this one is more rounded. And then this one is a little rounded, but more flat and easy to push down because it's a thinner canvas. Now inside it, I'll show you what's inside this one because I was I had it on my um, vanity over there. So I just have a um, Peach Slices Citri Honey Aqua Glow by um, Peach Slices. This is the um, Peach and Lily brand. I have a um, Sugar Advanced Therapy Fresh Lip Treatment. And then I have my Chanel Le Tan Spray that was sitting in there. And that's all that was inside of this one. I was just using it for some cosmetics, having it sit out and in, in use for a little while because it needed some use. This baby never really gets used because I actually find these a little too big to keep in my bags. Um, maybe if I had a little bit bigger of a bag, but mine are just a little too small for it. So once I get a bigger bag, of course I will use them because I love them. Um, I just don't really get too much use out of them and then when it comes to traveling i don't really use it as much either because i tend to use this piece more and this piece just fits my needs for traveling a little more when it comes to cosmetics however i do still love these pieces i will never get rid of them because i i really do collect them i'm um almost thinking about buying the race one uh however i did just purchase a um Expensive-ish, lower, lower end expensive-ish item from Louis Vuitton from the new Virgil collection. The very first one he released, I got something small. It was $308 after tax, so if that helps you a little bit, guessing. Um, but I will unbox it as soon as it comes in. I bought it last night at midnight, whenever they released everything online. So yeah, this is what I got. Let me show you what fits in it or what I like to carry in it. So right now my keys aren't gonna be in here because they're over there and I don't really keep them in here anyways. I kind of keep this inside of my book sack or um, on my passenger seat and then I take it in wherever I need. But really it's mostly inside of my book sack and then on the front pocket of my book sack I put my keys. So what I have in here is the Samorga organizer and inside of this I have my Louis Vuitton round coin purse that was down here inside of this back slip pocket. And what it is is this beautiful coin purse from Louis Vuitton. Unzips like so and then opens up. And I've just been keeping some cash in here. I have a $50 bill and a $1 bill just to have some cash on me. Oops. Um, so I just keep those down in there and then keep that in the back. That way I don't have to keep cash inside of my um, wallets. So I will slip that back there into that. The next thing I have is this beautiful blue lambskin. I'm using all of my blue pieces right now, well, some of them, um, to match this beautiful piece to go along with the style. And I'm using my orange Chanel, so you'll see that in a moment. But this is a beautiful blue lambskin. I love it. Unzip it on top to open up, and you see I have a um, fresh sugar lip balm pot a La Mer lip balm pot. Sorry to blind you if it has, because it's very mirror-like. Um, another one of those fresh um, advanced therapies, and then a little cleansing wipe thing for sunglasses, and then a bio, um, by I IB Guard. Um, this is for um, stomach issues. And that's all that was in there. It was really empty. Um, I do have my menu pushed yet also. Let's see. 
I'll also go over what was inside my mini pushette that was down inside of the bag also. Um, I'm kind of worried a little bit about this scratching up this, being that they are rubbing up against each other like that in the bag, but we will see. And then, so that's all that was in there. Let me stuff everything back in that real quick. Won't take long because there wasn't much. Ah, I'm sorry, my little, see this tag? Ah! Okay, so this item, I promise you, is way more functional than the seeming, but um, this little tab got stuck in there. So yeah, this will go right back down inside on the side. Right here, I have my Louis Vuitton. This is just the regular card case. I have this also in the dummy bin, which is right here, and I love this piece as well. This one's definitely a stiffer canvas than this one as well. But um, I love this piece. It just has my, some extra cards in it, some gift cards, things like that. And um, this just has a few extra cards in it. This is really more of like, I keep my club cards, things like that in here, shopping cards in here. And then I put that back down beside the um, pochette. And then beside it, I have two wallets, one of which is my orange Chanel, which I do still have the sticker on. And this has all of my credit cards from like my mom's account, my Mimi's account, those kind of things. Things I don't really ever use, but still need to have on me in case I need them to buy them something. And um, a sticker on top still, oops. And um, it's got a few things like my dad's driver's license, which I need to give back to him. Um, it's actually his ID, so it's fine. But, um, and then some gift cards, things like that in the inside. This is really just a, I have to have this wallet and keep it down into my bag. I really never use it um, unless it gets to that point in which I need to use it for some odd reason. And then the wallet that was beside that is my blue lambskin bifold Chanel. And that one has my ID in it, which I will cover up. Two cards here, two cards back there, two cards back there, and two cards on the outside pocket. I love this piece. This is the same leather as this piece. And they're beautiful. Do have separate hardwares, however. And you know, they may be a slightly bit different, but they're pretty much the same. I love it. I love this lambskin blue. My boyfriend always buys me these, except I actually bought this one for myself. Yeah, so that is what I had down inside of here. Um, let's go ahead and go into what I had in my mini pochette. We will zip this one up and then we'll get to the price of this at the end of the video. Um, oh, I'm in love with that. I just keep looking at it. So in my mini pochette, this is the mini pochette by Louis Vuitton. This one is kind of new to my collection. Um, I have, if you unzip it, inside of here, I have the Cartier um, ring pouch for my rings. I keep inside of there in case I have to take them off at work. Some cards, club cards, gift cards, cards to like my PayPal account, more gift cards, some sales associate cards, a key card to my old apartment, which we still have for a long time. And um, yeah, so that's also down inside of here. Um, I am having to purchase less because we do have the two apartments right now. Um, and that was a weird choice, but yeah. So I, inside of here, also have two tickets to the zoo in New Orleans, which are still good for 30 days. So I'll be going there again. Um, I have my boyfriend's Mustang key, some eye drops, um, a hand sanitizer by Bath and Body Works. This is the A Thousand Wishes one. And then I have one of my favorite lip balms, which is the Clarins um, Lip Comfort Oil. And this one is in the Honey. I also have it in the Mint, and I love that one also. Let's see, what what is this? Oh, and then this is the little pouch for my Mignon Fage ring, which is this ring, and I love my ring, which I will clean right after this video. Actually, I'm going to clean both all of my items, but this is a really fairly new piece to my collection. I do love it, and I have just ordered the organizer from Samorga for it. Um, Samorga, you should sponsor me because I'm overpaying for it. I'm just kidding. Actually, y'all have really great prices, Samorga. Um, I'm actually very excited to try it. I have one for all of my... Um, toiletries I actually think I'm gonna need to get an orange one to go down inside of here and it's gonna be amazing but I have the um let's see I have this one in the tan for my 26s I just have one and then um let's see down here 
I have the one for my 15. Look how cute it is. Super cute in this mustard color. And then I have a blue one for my toiletry 19, which I absolutely also love with all of my heart. So yeah, thank you guys for, oh wait, just kidding, pause. We're gonna go over the price. So as you know, when it comes to limited edition pieces, the price goes up. After not being sold in the store, you will not pay around about the price that the store was. You're gonna pay a premium. It's gonna be pre-loved, it's gonna be used, and you're still gonna pay a huge premium. So we definitely paid a premium, or my boyfriend did, out of our accounts. Um, and that's okay, because it's an item I really wanted, and I'm excited about it. So inside of here has all of your stuff. This is your certificate, fashion file certificate. Um, Authenticity for life. Shop, sell, repeat, all that kind of stuff. I don't really use any of these because I don't really ever sell my stuff back to Fashion File once I buy it. I love those things. Oh, okay, so this is not the paper I need. Okay, well, it's, he put it on layaway and then paid 147 first, but his last, so it was 147, it doesn't tell me the total total. So it's 147 paid layaway, and then it's 650 he paid a second time. So it's at seven, is it six? 798, 798 for this piece, and I believe it is absolutely worth it. This is something I will have for the rest of my life sitting on my shelf, even if I'm not using it, as a display piece. I would love, love, love one day to have a huge collection for everybody to come see. But yeah, so um, that is my new piece. I absolutely love it. Um, I have some more pieces coming, like I said, from the Virgil collection and well one piece and i will be unboxing that as soon as it comes in because i am super excited to see it let me know if you want to see any other videos and thank you so much for watching um bye bye